Hello, everyone. Welcome back to JSA TV and JSA Podcast live here at DCD London. We are here. I'm here with Pete, uh, JSA TV guest and a friend, uh, Kara Massini, Chief Sustainability Officer at Switch Data Centers. Thank you for joining us again on JSA TV, Kara. Thank you for having me. Absolutely. So I think we'll just jump right in here. Um, and so first of all, we have to talk energy, renewable energy. It's the number one topic at, of the day, right? Um, so your work focuses a lot on navigating these uh, energy demands and renewable energy goals for the data center industry. So how do you kind of see this concept of energy expansion versus energy transition impacting the industry's sustainability goals? Yeah, so that's a whole topic to unpack. Um, energy transition and uh, and expansion at the same time, mm -hmm. they go hand in hand. Um, so what the way we look at the the energy, you know, uh, challenge, if you will, uh, both the expansion and the transition, is to look at locations where we can combine that uh, mm -hmm. in in one go. So basically, when we develop data centers, we look at where where do we have the power available, where you know where is there still a pocket of um, of capacity. Uh, and also, where can we bring some of that energy back into society? So, for instance, uh, a number of projects that we're working on uh, bring, bring energy back to society. We'll talk a little bit more about that later on. But it's a mix and match of uh, trying to find the right location at the right spot for a number of things. Where it used to be a lot about, you know, connectivity is still, the connectivity, uh, fiber connectivity is still an important factor as well. Uh, the location. I mean, you have to have the land available. Yeah, there's so many things you you, you need need to have the carbon allowance at that particular spot as well. So there's so many things that that you know you have to put the puzzle together. But the mm -hmm. energy uh, part of that is is one of the main ones, and transition and expansion go hand in hand. Yeah, absolutely. And um, of course, you uh, have extensive experience in the industry. You've been at Netflix, in fact, before Switch yeah. Data Centers, and now Chief Sustainability Officer at Switch Data Centers. So, how can you talk a little bit more about Switch with its focus on sustainability? How you kind of um, this this it, what's becoming an age old question of how do you balance your growth targets, which are yep. substantial with yep. your sustainability targets yeah so that's that's uh, first and foremost you need to you know measure and and uh, be able to know where you're at uh, mm -hmm. before you start further developing and and improving um, so it's it's um, basically you build the capability to um, you know uh, to know and, and to, to and and therefore uh, you can improve on it mm -hmm. um, and so a lot of that um, savviness in terms of where you build as I just spoke about um, and where and how you develop and how you how you you know uh, basically put together a structure in a location where there is already a carbon, uh, sorry, a, a concrete slab or, or a structure that's already there. So there is, there is a lot of things that you can do to be more sustainable um, without really, um, you know, without large capital investment. Um, mm -hmm. And of course, when we develop, we look at things like how can we improve on the uh, sustainability of a new build. Mm -hmm. um, but there's also, uh, you know, just to look at where can you be more sustainable in your current operations, right. um, you know, things like waste, procurement and all that. So there's a whole, that's what I like so much about this role. You, you have interactions with all of the different, um, you know, elements of the company. Yeah. Whether it's build and development or operations, um, and even you know when when a customer would leave us at some point, yeah. there is that circular uh, you know uh, element to that. How right. do they leave? Where do they leave their their you know their equipment? How do they dispose of it and all that? Right. It's a very good sign that you are involved in every stage because that means that Switch is thinking about sustainability at every stage, right? Yep. And throughout all of its projects. So that's that's very good to hear. Yep. Um, and so to, to kind of round us out on this uh, topic, uh, overall topic around sustainability, could you speak a little bit about heat reuse? Because I know Switch Data Centers has been kind of an early leader in that area. Um, so can you just tell us a little bit about whatever kind of comes to mind for that, any projects you might want to talk about? Yeah, so there's a number 
number of projects that we're working on. Um, one is on our uh, one of our newest uh, locations that's currently operational. It's all prepared for heat reuse. It's mm -hmm. actually, you know, if there was a taker tomorrow, we could we could work with them. Uh, but we're actually working on a project with the municipality of Diemen, uh, mm -hmm. which is like ne right next to Amsterdam. If you if you yeah, <laughs> from um, uh, seen from from far away. So um, and there we are looking at how what is the best way to implement that district heating network um, and uh, is it going to be low uh, temperature, medium temperature, and and what is the best structure for the, the people in the you know the, do they need a heat uh, pump or what, whatever they need in the houses. So there's a that it's not easy, right? Mm -hmm. it's, these these projects are always complicated. There is a municipality involved. There are you know uh, citizens involved. There is an operator of the heat reuse network involved. Um, but you know uh, there is a positive vibe um, to that, and um, and it's it's happening. And one of the other projects that I'm really excited about um, is our new development in the midst of 50 greenhouses, where we will be able to give heat back to uh, 50, the, the greenhouse farmers. Mm -hmm. Amazing. Um, so basically, we get renewables into the data center. They get used by the customers. And then we give the heat back uh, to those greenhouse farmers around the uh, around the data center. Yeah. So basically, we're growing crops. Yeah, right? it's, <laughs> I love it. Yeah, I like now that. you're farmers. <laughs> who'd, who, who'd have known? Uh, amazing. Well, great. Yeah. Thank you so much for the updates on what Switch Data Centers is up to. Um, I know you have a very busy week. I saw your panel yesterday, oh, yeah. Yeah. so you're yeah. running around. Uh, so we will we will let you go. But thank you so much for joining us on JSA TV. And thank you to viewers for hanging out with us here live at DCD London. Happy networking, everyone. Thank you.